Hello, D.D. Berry here. I'm going to do a short review of the Old Town Discovery 119 canoe. On the film here, you see my Grumman aluminum canoe that I got in 1977 and my Old Town Discovery 119 that I got this year, 2018. And you see my cat that's going to help with the review. Or maybe not. Anyhow, the aluminum canoe has a disadvantage that it's noisy on the water. If you hit the canoe with the paddle, you'll hear the sound go across the lake of wherever you're at. The plastic old town will be quieter on the water, but it doesn't hold up quite as well as the aluminum. The aluminum transfers the temperature of the water to the inside of where you're setting. And so on a hot day, that may be good. And on a cold day, now that could be bad. The old town is made of polyethylene with some foam in between, some of the plastic, and the foam insulates you from the water, making it a little bit warmer, and if you hit it with a paddle or something, it's not as noisy. Let's take a close-up look here as I walk down. You can see the Old Town logo, and you can see the Discovery 119. Discovery is part of the name they made up, and the 119 comes from the length. It's 11 foot, 9 inches. 11 and 9, 119. You can see here, Old Town points out in the literature, there's Kitty again, Old Town points out in its literature that it has two handles. Well, two handles can be handy, I guess, but if it's a solo canoe, you're probably going to be by yourself. And so who's going to help you with the other handle? So the other way to carry it would be to put it on your back and portage it from here to the car or truck or van. The only trouble is there's no portage yoke. There's not one made for this. And if you did have one, it would probably go where the seat is. So if you, fasten, if you did make a yoke and fasten it in, then you couldn't use the seat. So I think if you're thinking about buying one of these, that's a serious consideration is whether you want a portage yoke. I put this up on my back and I put a towel around my neck and across my back and the seat real kind of rests on your back then, but it's not as comfortable as a portage yoke. Now, the first time I took the Grumman out, I didn't have a portage yoke, and I, I was out 10 days portaging every day. And I used a towel across my, my back. I hadn't planned to do that, but that's the way it turned out. So anyhow, if you're thinking about the Old Town Canoe, think about the fact that it doesn't have a portage yoke. It only weighs 50 pounds, 48 pounds to be exact. But for me, I'm 72, that weight is reasonably heavy. And so I would like to put it on my back rather than try to hold it up with two hands. So that's the end of my review for right now. It is a nice canoe. It's made nice, it looks nice. And I'll do a video later 
where I have it on the water. But for right now, the, my cat and I say goodbye.